Good afternoon. I'm Andre Kutsia, the CEO of Henley Air, a helicopter operation based in Johannesburg, South Africa. We've been around since 1995 and operate a large fleet of helicopters uh, since our initiation in, uh, into the industry in 1998. We specialize in helicopter charter, we do flight training through our flight school, we do maintenance, and we operate in the region of 30 different helicopters of various sizes, various roles, and various applications. The bulk of our business, other than the helicopter charter or air taxi, is the precious metal transportation around Johannesburg specifically and the surrounding provinces. We do a lot of stolen vehicle recovery, also the uh, advanced flight school and an air ambulance service of which we're very proud. Since 2007, my role as CEO changed somewhat. I used to operate uh, helicopters, obviously, deal with pilots, deal with aircraft mainly, but I came to realize that my role was about to change in managing the egos of many people around the hangar, more so my own. And I came to the realization that pilots, students, and owners of aircraft suddenly became the focus of my day. And that raised very specific safety concerns. Of course, a, general, a gross generalization to say and think that everyone has an, a, a problem with his ego, that certainly isn't the case. But it was very prominent and raised safety concerns specifically in the hire and fly realm uh, where students and or owners could use their machines and fly away for the weekend. Another significant uh, observation at the time was we only used freelance pilots which contributed to a number of incidents, unfortunately accidents as well, and subsequently raised our insurance claim record and increased premiums over years. Further through that, the management intervention that we initiated in 2015 addressed very specific Henley Air safety culture issues. The new safety processes and systems that we initiated focused heavily on safety programs more so initial and recurrent training programs for our pilots. Other than just the normal training regimes, we incorporated a night vision goggle or NVG program as well, specifically relating to our air ambulance services. This also had the advantage of an enhanced safety management system that we incorporated through our in-house safety office and which we're very proud of. Our people-centered approach in terms of raising the bar safety-wise was to reconsider our employment mode and we opted to go for full-time employment of pilots which was an, a, a no-go for us many years ago. To that end we em employed 20 new pilots in, within the vehicle tracking realm but also the highly specialized e EMS or emergency me medical service uh, space which has had a, a significant positive effect on our, on our business. In addition to that and not only stopping at the training we incorporated coaching and mentoring programs on an ongoing basis, which has been very beneficial to our crew. Uh, we've, we've reaped the rewards in that sense, whereby crews now can interact with aviation psychologists within our business, and also a mentorship team that looks at career guidance, uh, mapping uh, a career path beyond Henley Air, and perhaps even beyond the aviation industry and the helicopter industry specifically. A further addition to our training offering specifically is a Bell 222 simulator that we developed from scratch. Uh, we're proud of this addition to our training uh, battery uh, in the sense that it's the only 222 simulator in the world and runs concurrently with the size of our fleet uh, of which we uh, operate eight air ambulances in, and, and other configurations. We base the training models that we develop annually on evidence-based training uh, scenarios from our own crews. So we would extract uh, data from specific EMS missions, from the vehicle tracking missions, even charter missions, and based on that then develop our, our offering in the simulator that the instructors then incorporate. As alluded to earlier, our Henley Care team is the coaching and mentoring facet that we incorporate and everyone that's willing and voluntary uh, available for uh, further coaching and mentoring within our business. Um, this extends to hangar staff, it extends to pilots, our maintenance staff, our paramedics. Everyone that is interested is welcome to join that and it's had a hugely positive uh, effect. In closing and perhaps as a takeaway 
to what we do at Henley Air and what we've experienced over time is that our insurance rates have dropped significantly. We were able to reduce the number of accidents, incidents and hazards significantly, which has also obviously contributed to lower maintenance costs. Um, having not realized the effect thereof specifically uh, prior to 2015 and then for the period between 2007 and 2015, the advantage that we've seen of the incorporated models specifically in the processes and systems and a people-based intervention has really been significant. The ma lower maintenance cost obviously ultimately leads to a lower premiums of which we're proud and we can offer to our clients and to our, our owners and also to our students. More so, the, the sense of camaraderie that we've experienced between our crews having full-time employment and a great increase in the morale of everyone, uh, including our Joburg base, the Durban base and the Cape Town base has been substantial. We've piggybacked that on a just culture that we've incorporated in terms of hazard reporting, in terms of safety issues raised with our safety office and that has really increased our safety indicators over time with a distinct downward trend of which we're very proud. Uh, in closing, we believe that the enhanced safety culture that we've seen at Henley Air, as measured uh, scientifically through the Commercial Aviation Safety Survey, has been evident. And we are moving forward uh, at a reduced uh, rate of incidents, accidents. However, our reporting system has picked up drastically, which excites auditors and excites the safety office. I thank you for this opportunity and I invite you to visit henleyair.co.za. Thank you.